Hello, what's up, guys? That's your guy again, Carlos Albert, and uh, it's Saturday. So, what do we have on a Saturday? We have this Dell laptop. This is Dell Latitude D620, and the laptop was booked in as no display. So, this laptop is not displaying, but it's turning on. So, this is some kind of uh, old machine. If you check most of my videos, which I'm uploading, it's about this kind of machine. Why? Because it's about country. We are still living in a developing country, and the most of people in my country, they can't afford like expensive laptops. So, yeah, we are, we are like... 10, well, like 10 years brand with technology, 10, 15 years brand with technology. So we have to, to fix this machine, okay? So if you are living in a developing country like Zimbabwe, probably you are in the right channel because we shall upload many, many kind of videos of these old types of laptops. But to, have, to someone who is in, living in the United Kingdom, USA, developed country, uh, yeah, this might not be useful because they dumped this kind of machine long, long ago. So, what I want to do, we do have the charger here. You know, the laptops, they are nice. The charger has got light. That's indicate that the power is passing from the AC adapter to this far end of the charger. So, what I will do, I will plug the charger. We still have light. I'll try to power on the laptop. Was we have to see what this laptop is doing exactly. So on, you can see the LEDs here. One beep, and uh, we don't have anything on the screen. You see. But I can see here some, some LED which indicates that the laptop is on. And I can hear the sound of the fan spinning. But we have nothing on the screen. So that's what we have to fix. You see this light? Maybe you can't see. Yeah. Maybe you can't see it by reflection, but if I do something like this, you will see that light. This one. So that light indicates that this laptop already I press the power on button. The microcontroller is reading up all the power supply to check if everything is okay. And if everything okay is okay, the EC chip is com communicating with the with the the graphics in that way it will post picture on the screen so in this case we have nothing on the screen no picture no light the screen is just a blank so we have to understand few things. This laptop was released so many years ago. Let me check if I may check desktop uh dual attitude D620 here yeah, release dual attitude D620 was released early 2006 you see something like uh, 16 17 years ago before things were proper made so based on time i don't think they were making fake things everything is 
in on those days was a real components the parts everything was a real so what can be fault here let's unplug the charger because we need to get inside the laptop let's try to get inside this laptop if we can We have some screws here. So, what can be fault here? We might be lucky to be RAM memory. That's the lucky case when the RAM is full on such kind of machine. But, uh, Based on the model of the laptop, I would say a good starting point is to try to, re to locate the graphic chip. I don't think we have a problem with any power supply here. I don't think so. I don't think so. So that's the laptop. Let's unplug this connector for the keyboard. That the keyboard is out. You can see this kind of dust on the fan. We have the rim here. DDR2 512 megabytes. Let's put big. Let's re try to refit the rim. Charger. Maybe on no, we have nothing on the screen. We don't have anything on the screen. What I would try, I'll try to swap the rim. with another RAM that's the RAM which is 512 so I will swap with this one just to to make sure that you don't have a RAM issue here Can see the power on light, but there's nothing on the screen. The screen is still black, so it's not about the rim. It's not about the rim. So what I would do, I, would, I shall try it tricky. We drive the processor here in the heat sink underneath the heat sink we have the fan and the heat sink under this heat sink we have the intel processor 
and the next year we have the graphic chip and that the PCH so I don't want to take the whole thing out because it's Saturday you know Saturday things let's try to do shortcuts here let's try to do shortcuts we need to get access to the graphic chip without yeah that should be fine you see that the graphics you see it this one that the graphic chip under the heat sink so we need to do some tricks here because I don't think we have a faulty laptop or power supply things I don't think we have a fault power supply here so what I'll do I'll apply so that in pests at the edges of the graphic chip because if we have no picture that would be my first suspect based on what I see was this fan is it's got too much dust so it's very possible that this chip died due to due to fan issue maybe the fan is not working properly so 434a and i'll try to refill the graphic chip I'm coming with the heat around the graphic chip on the edges That's fine. Uh, let's wait for the chip to cool down. Well, at least we are waiting for the graphic chip to cool down. Let's clean up the fan. Yeah, uh, this fan has got too much dust. Let's clean up this fan just a little bit. <laughs> yeah, now looks better. Let's see, put back this rim which you took out. Now we need the keyboard. Oh. Keyboard. We 
is my charger. On. And you have picture. You see? Check here. Invalid information, what, what. And it's working fine. I think some of the keys of the keyboard they are not working. You can see. So that's how you can fix, and uh, that's how you can diagnose and fix something like that. So if you have uh, such kind of old laptop, it's coming on but no picture. The first suspect is the graphic chip. The fan is not spinning. But I can hear the I can feel the temperature from the heat sink. Let's try to to put some some heat because I want to see if this fan is still alive or is dead. That's what I want to see. I'm putting it on top of the heat sink. Yeah, the fan is spinning, you can see. So, we still have a good fan. You can see? Fan is spinning, non-stop. So, this job is done like subscribe don't forget to turn on the notification you have a nice weekend wherever you are that was just a simple one a 40 graphics and remember what we have done here it's not like a cure we do not cure we do not 100 percent solve the problem here get me right this laptop can work like two months like one month, one year, two years, depending on the stages at which the graphic chip is about to die. Because this is an indication that the graphic chip is no longer good. So we just treat, give a treatment so that the customer will be in a position to do like a backup of files. But... Uh, the only permanent solution, according to me, is to change the motherboard. I don't think rebolling will solve the problem here. So, like, subscribe. Also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any quality content from our channel. I can see the channel is growing. I don't, I can't even believe it's growing very fast. So, see you on the next one. Bye.